everyone, and welcome back to O Long Fallen Dynasty. New patch just dropped today. Um, I quickly went over the patch notes, who mostly has to do with item drop rates and stuff, you know, being able to get better quality gear and such, or better quality gear quicker. Basically, it affects most or all of levels, as far as I can tell, once you've cleared them once, so on repeat visits, you know, when you actually start farming for equipment, it would be easier to get good stuff. But since we're not really in that stage of the game yet, I don't think the patch will affect us that much. But, you know, it's nice to know that it's there. And we can make use of it if we should go and uh, repeat a level. Also, the travel menu... ...should now show you... yeah. Like, if you... yeah, exactly. Like, if you look uh, there at the, you know screen preview you can now see if you found the jikata cell shells uh the dragon vein stuff and the shiji show so it's easier to you know creep, keep track of those collectibles and i guess that is also if you found a note or not so that's kind of sweet makes you know completion a little bit easier there they can just say like, yeah have you found all of the things or not i suppose look i'm gonna keep my collectible guide open just to you know keep track of this a little bit easier but yeah it tells me that there is one shitty show in this mission and that is actually what we're gonna go ahead and do that next or we do darkness over the Honshuyu River. A lot of more stuff. So lost artifact this also did do or you know started using new items, so it's probably a good idea to go ahead and try this out. Alright. Then John put a burning Liu Yang behind him and marched on to Zhang Yang. Sutenius Cheng Pu and Wang Gai made haste to follow his tracks, but suddenly they saw their lord return to the still smoldering ruined capital. Whatever could Sun Zhan be doing returning to Liang? Look into this in their stead. <coughs> I know they, they pronounce Sun differently, it's more like Xin? Dun? Oh, well. Also, I. Hope you don't hear the drilling going on in the background because our neighbor is at it again. I really don't know what they need so much drilling for. Like they've been going on the whole day yesterday already. Oh, I like this. I like this very much. Huh, 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 huh. What is this again? Alright. I mean, I'm not particularly fond of the look of the weapon, even though, yes, I know I chose this one over its initial one. But I like that even less. <laughs> Excuse me? No enemies here, huh? Hmm. And that's a lot of rank 5 steel that we just got. I have to admit, I just really like the overall pacing of the game. Like, it is very fast and fluid and responsive and all these nice words. Like, if you compare that with the um, deliberate uh, piece that, like, say, Neo had, this feels so much smoother. Okay, I love Neo, don't get me wrong. But this Neo was very deliberate in his design, whereas this is more freeform, which I guess makes sense. Yeah, because in Neo, you were playing as a samurai who very meticulously plans out his movement and such whereas you know the whole chinese thing tends to be a little bit more fluid in a way with the whole wuxia genre and whatnot ah 
Fancy meeting you here. Who are you? I'm supposed to be looking for detox jerky, which has an exotic flavor. Husband. Do you have business around these parts as well? I can give you the fucking jerky so you can fuck off. That there, isn't that the detox jerky I'm after? I know it's rude to ask, but might you be able to spare some? I could have given that to your wife back in the village. You didn't even have to call me a buddy. Thank you. Now I can be on my way home. Oh, this tastes between just us. Hmm. Sure. Thank you. Now I can be on. Oh. Sure, 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 sure. <laughs> Making this buddy look good in front of his wife. Just, I think he just wanted to be a bit of a hero. A tally with the resub money. Praise the beaver. Even though we are currently not playing Cult of Beaver. We're gonna praise it. Because as a follower, we are legally required to always praise the beaver, right? Right? You can't just stop praising the beaver. It's a lifelong commitment. I suppose. Just shreds. Uh, their spirit too, doesn't it? A little bit dismayed though that it didn't kill that guy. Because I wasn't paying close attention to the damage numbers, to be fair. Ah, uh, that is just a cure, but right? Yeah. Think like that attack should have killed this guy. Let's let me try it on with sword here, just so I get a feel for it. Wow, okay. that one. Oh, that is why you're such a nuisance. Wow. Jesus, fuck. This sword was a bit annoying. How many of these uses can I hold on? Was it eight? Can I pick this up? Seven. All right. Fair enough. Oh, that's a big guy. Hello there, sir. Can I interest you in a ah, fuck? Oh, falling down the thing, I suppose. Coming back. Where did he go? <laughs> oh, here he goes. their spirit <clears throat> mm -hmm. yes please let's talk about that enemy that we lost I guess we'll meet him again at some point oh 
Hello. Fancy meeting you here. Guess I just really want to drop attack you down there. Like this attack. Funny. Um, a little more orientation though. Yeah, that is what the guy win. Yeah, so I want to check out this part first. Yeehaw. Did that guy up, respawn up top? I think it probably did. Don't like fighting you head on. That just shreds these enemies. Jesus. Hey, that's a shitty show. Hey, what can I give you? Mm. I guess I can give you this one. Eh, yeah, why not? Yeah, have something to eat. Little bastard. Dense container. Oh, is that a accessory? Yes, it is. So HP, range, spirit damage. Uh, yeah, no. Nah. Not worth it. And the force you need to push a blunt object straight through person. Oof, we are strong. I mean, you have what? Like he does it clearly in the middle of the body, so he has to push through the spine and possibly the rib cage. That is some serious force we are applying there. Holy shit. <laughs> this is a good ability. I like using this ability. And then we're back here, yeah. Oh, you know what? You know what I can do? Get my hands and pick up this now. Ha! 
Smart. Back on a track. Hell for I suppose. I just wanted to see if I can just bomb rush her. I mean, kind of work. Also, kind of didn't. Definitely was a bit of a give or take situation there. Yeah, we're late to the party. Oh, you too. you wasn't there kind of look like apes something maybe they are ah fuck Go this way, so I'm missing one walking back. Why would you come towards us? Why would you jump on the fire to die? Let's review this guy's life choices. <clears throat> He's a ranged fighter. He had uh, the upper ground bag there, guarded by a couple other enemies. If you choose to engage in melee combat with us by running into a fiery pit, and trying to jump up to our location, which he clearly wasn't able to reach. He died in the fire. Okay. <laughs> Idiot. The last it is delayed, and I'm trying to go for that one. Oh, there it is. Found it. of these guys, huh? Ah, 
Emma guy and a double halberd guy. Correction, it's a hammer guy. Correction, we beat them. they've made a very good investment into this weapon very good investment imperial seal made it i see you have regained the imperial seal is that what you were after for generations it has been the heirloom of the rightful sovereign i shall take it for safekeeping <laughs> And in doing so, take another step toward realizing my dream. That is not Sunjon. That is the Black Taoist. Oh, come on, not again. Ah. Uh... Um. Let's quickly go back to the village. Check if we've got anything new and then we can just continue on with the story. <clears throat> oh, that is why he returned to the capital. You know, he. Because that wasn't him at all. I suppose got armor. Oh, they finally introduced that feature. Good. God damn it, I was missing that the whole time. Holy shit, and I finally listened. Even though I didn't even say anything. <laughs> oh, that makes this so much better. Okay, it looks like my microphone doesn't pick up on the drilling in the background, so that is at least good. Ass and footwear. Yeah, it doesn't look like we picked up anything great here, so I'm gonna get rid of all of that. And it's another belt hook. Stone attack power. Like, is range spirit damage? No, oh, by range damage. Do we do spells count as ranged attacks? I mean, I guess they could, but I don't think they do. Oh yeah, titles. Got another cup of cordiality. Chivalrous Assassin Slayer. Victory Unscathed. I mean, you can probably do that pretty quickly on a higher difficulty once you have better armors and shit. Yeah, you know what? Let's just continue on then. Shell. Uh, we can level up though. Oh, 
I think I will continue putting points into metal for now to increase our attack power on this other virtue. Increases that more, but I don't think it does. So a metal it is. Darkness over the Hanshui River. Do it. Things I was just too young to ash. The lords, who already had their own intentions, also left, causing the coalition to disband. The chaos shows no sign of stopping, but instead intensifies. As Sun John's army attacks Zhang Yang, who has to circulate that the tower is in black, so no good. I mean, is he ever up to any good? Don't think he is. Also, he will never be. <clears throat> uh, okay. All right. All right. How do we have here? Arrows. Ah, come on. Guess we are not supposed to drop into the water. <laughs> he says and nearly falls in. Oh, that probably just gives you a jumping attack on the lady there. Okay. Oh, that actually slows you down because you're in the mud. Okay, so we had to free that boat in order to be able to continue here, I suppose. Troops here get around by boat. To wage war in a region like this, you need more than just cavalry. It is said that one who never stops exploring is a master of all terrain. And thus, we swim should one day be able to use the rivers to our advantage too. Just climb down, or we can drop down. And you little ass. Yeah, I guess I can go down there. Come here. Drop kick your ass. <laughs> ah. You got this? You got this. Oh my god, the NPC actually did something good. Can't believe it. Why is this still not usable though? Looks like we've got a phone is not a pushover for once. Ah. Yes. I see. Oh shit, that was not what I wanted to use. Want to use this. <laughs> I 
Next time you need a helping hand, I'll be there. Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess now we can get the battle flag, yes. Yeah, I forgot about these things. Okay, we can't come here until we find another boat over there, so we have to go this way. Gotcha. We just to see how a speed of this game works, you know, with the uh, morale system. She kind of got bullied to death, I'm gonna lie. There's also the fact that you can't find equipment that is already upgraded, so you don't, oh, so you don't have to do that yourself. Just that little convenience. I mean, then again, obviously, uh, near the same thing. But I think it's more impactful here because there aren't as many upgrade levels, as far as I can tell, at least. For now. I actually can't remember how quickly all the upgrade levels exploded in Neo again. Bamboo crossbow. Maybe I should actually start upgrading my ranged weapons as well. But then again, there has to be better stuff than bamboo. Maybe not. Hello. You look pretty fierce and intimidating. Attack. Mr. Crane. Oh, hello. Like, first of all, why didn't you attack one of my compatriots? Second, why did you guys allow that to happen? Raise them immediately. Fail you again. NPC allies, that is. Me, that I'm just blind, and I'm just not finding any of these mocking flags. Maybe they're all just in very quick succession when we come into the mainland again or something? I don't know. Excuse me? <coughs> but there is a lot of the fact that you get an immediate health regain and, you know, uh, regain all your dragon cure pots when you just plant the flanks without having to respawn the enemies. That's just really nice and comfortable. I like it. So it allows you to get a checkpoint without, you know, the negative side effects of it. How did that guy notice me? That is just bullshit. Oh my god.
Can you guys like handle one enemy? Appreciation. <laughs> I mean, it's all just because you two hot heads rushed straight into defeating that warlock. That's same. Did you defeat him? Yes. Did you take a beating by doing so? Also, yes. Also, hi. It's me. There's a mocking flag. I hope that is the first one. Otherwise, I will cry a little bit. Guess we can't get back up there. So, did I miss my opportunity for jumping attack on the lady here? Did not. I wonder how you can actually see these enemies before they surface. Well, Marking flag beneath us, I suppose. Skip powder wasn't the thingy thing, was it? No. Deli was not. It's up from this side. that many other sides oh ah no All of this is shut down. Um. Oh, here. 
I see. Okay. Ooh. Lucky. Oh, hello. You know, you guys can't evade that, right? Just saying, oh my god, I don't want to fight you on the riggedy scaffolding there. I can help it. Especially not with you supporting him. Which you won't be doing anymore. actually the way forward wow that's some sight you could probably even see it from across the hunchway river i'd like to be lord of a huge stronghold like this one day first we rescue father and rid the area of demons then with our combined strength we will take this city and make it our new stronghold in jing province i like the sound of that we better get this finished up properly then ever the hothead could I have handled that better? Absolutely. Did I? No. Uh, how do I get back from here? Don't tell me I can't return. Game, okay, please. I had stuff left over there. But there's a bridge. Oh, right. Um. Well, shit. Is there really no way back? I'll be the first. <sighs> ah, thank God. It was as simple as a jump. And backstabbing this bastard. You don't die? Oh, thank God. But I have no idea where the two idiots are. So, uh, rip them. I have no idea where you guys went. Oh, I guess I'm on my own from here now.
Honestly, I have no idea where they went. Oh, there they are. There's one of them. Oh, there. Yeah, you probably felt somewhere in the water. That is why you basically have no HP left. All righty then. Um, just to make sure that we didn't miss any of the marking. I'd like to. Should be good. Did you just fall in that little gap or something? Also, I'm an idiot once more and forgot to recharge my headset's batteries for the stream, or rather I forgot to change them. I'm gonna do this little exercise again. Go. Oh. Because obviously I wouldn't like to play this without any sound, that is just... Hamstringing yourself. Why did that last hit not connect? I was supposed to get that from the other boat. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Can I pull you? I can. Yes, I you can kill stuff in this game. Okay. 
Okay, so pirates scribblings. Rank six level. Um, how do I get back? That would be low enough for us to reach it first, but hey, okay. Elite sniper, wrong Zhu. Why is that elite sniper charging at us with a melee weapon? Are you dumb or something? Doesn't seem very elite nor snipery to me. That was uh, rather pathetic. <laughs> I mean, he was there. <laughs> the next moment, he wasn't. <laughs> hey, look at that. How dare you, sir? How dare you interrupt my attack? I don't want Q powder. I want the thingy thing. All the veil stuff. You know what I mean, right? You do. Don't you even try and deny it. Shitting me. And that guy really knows when to annoy me. Next time you need help. My fuck. These guys really know when to interrupt you, don't they? Oh, hello. Let's try that approach again. Now the one thing I don't like about this weapon is this running strike that takes way too long to come out.
I think there might be treasure hidden in the area. Mm -hmm. Good. I'm sure you'll make good use of it. I wouldn't exactly call that hidden, but whatever floats your boat, I suppose. So that doesn't work. I guess we are supposed to go onto the battlement first. Go from there. Can you get out of the way, buddy? Oh wait, did I miss one? But you can double jump. But then nobody told me they can double jump in this game. Oh my lord. Not know that. I don't know you can freaking double jump this game. Best game ever. Because you can't go this way. Oh wow. First we had all this shit. Now we have this too. Okay. Let the change in scenery. So what am I hearing here? Was these guys? You're getting so much support, buddy. Hey 
there. What do I have for you? That's the only three star thing I picked up. Damn. I guess I can give you this. How about it, buddy? Or fair classics. Enemy detection. HP, divine best gauge gain, burns, cumulative. Hmm. Wait, enemy detection isn't too bad. But not really needed. pretty bloody i mean i guess it just fits the overall style seeing how many enemies we have already felt this mission oh i'm kidding Can you? Can you really? Doesn't look like it. You saved my skin. Now let me show my appreciation. I'm saving a skin pretty often, buddy. Just saying. Let's just take one step at a time here. Is actually the way forward? Oh no, it is an alternative way. In a sense. Yeah, ah, okay. I see how it is. I've been down there. Oh, yeah, yeah wait. Oh. oh, this is all the way here. We've passed the. Yeah, oh, now I see. I didn't think this door was open back then. Oh, hello. You're a bit late to the party. Black and our big friend here. this much morale before which explains why we are killing stuff so quickly i suppose oh 
Oh, hello. Ah! Hi. I think this is also the first time we hear some of the somber music in this game. Question is, can that enemy spot me from here? Can. Quite unfortunate. He snuck off right into the demon's midst. Right after lecturing me on the need for caution. By the time we arrived, Xiang Yang was already infested by a horde of demons. Let's hurry. I worry for my father's safety. Something tells you will actually fight Xiang Yang this time. He's gonna be our next boss fight. One attack, one kill. The mocking flag. Now the question obvious is how do we get up there? actually do all right cool. if that is our last battle flag Diary. Thank <laughs> you. 
Easy. Thing in you? Oh, thing. Come over here, do you, woman? Maybe you do. Oh, you know, you can also just double jump and make the distance. So it works. Much ground to cover here. Huh? Ah. I saw something move out of the corner of Mara just there, and then uh, didn't they really attack me? Also, why are none of you fighting? work okay but that is actually the way forward so let's take a moment and explore this area before we go there I don't know was I at the end of this one ah <laughs> Okay, that was actually the last one. Nice, we found them all. Good. Wait, is this blocked? Yeah, okay, so let's wait until we can open from the other side and then... Yeah, so we actually had to go all this way that we just went. Gotcha. That door. I was gonna say, how did she not notice that, but totally did. Okay, and that is the short cut back to the battle flank. Nice. That is going to be the boss fight, then. Okay. Wait, really?
actually supposed to jump over there? Really now. How are you supposed to make that jump? Taking some rest. You do not seriously intend to fight in that condition. Supposedly, you can make this jump. Can't we just do it from the other side? Thanks for nothing. Well, now we'll definitely go ahead and have to reset the battle flag. Which I guess works. Uh, we can level up and stuff. All levels is nice. Join me now. Tempt me all you may. I will not join forces with evil. Let Dato go. <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> 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 what did I say? <laughs> That's good. Huh. Well, they're not deflected.
She was pretty easy. I mean, we had two NPC allies, but still. This is what happens to those who disobey me. <laughs> Take heed for when the time comes for you to answer. You bastard! <laughs> Get back here! Curses! <laughs> Hey Rob. Thank you, thank you. Our Happy Friday. Strained us from completely losing ourselves to bloodlust. And then, in sacrificing his life, he set an example for all Swen descendants to follow. Swen. Our bloodline is not to give succor to the evildoers. We are to strengthen ourselves, and one day, bring order to this land. Your claws are not those of the tiger like ours. However, we want you present as we set off. And sail towards a bright future, as kings overseeing an era of prosperity for all. With our ship's helm adorned by that liar Taoist severed head. I totally forgot about my Divine Beast again, didn't I? <laughs> Why is I kept about it? Clearly, while my attention has been elsewhere, you have surpassed me. Both of you. Grow strong. And take care of your men. As commanders, you must be calm and collected. And Bofu, you are just like me. Always reckless. That man, he must be stopped. Dad! Hey, it's Jin. She's infiltrated Dong Zhou's forces alone. Would you go with me to Meiwu Fort? So the protection of the divine beast by who? Due to your strong bonds. But more importantly, we found rank six stuff. That's the really important stuff. It's gonna immediately boot me out to the next mission though, isn't it? Was that how she infiltrated them? <sighs> I mean, that is her, right?
wonderful display. Tell me your name. Diao Chan. Isn't it? One hundred ninety-two. That's another one-year time skip. Two years. Yeah, before we do all that. I mean, it says 109 even. Bit of fun everything here. Go back to the village and upgrade our equipment. Don't we all like full battle capacity? Why are you here? In the autumn, we all go to harvest the fields together. You're not here. I often got scolded when I was a child because I couldn't help taking a bite or two. <laughs> that big peach tree there has spiritual powers. There's an old legend about it. This place was once barren. When a crane came and landed on the tree, genuine chi then started spreading, causing greenery to sprout all over. And soon after, this village was founded for hermits seeking tranquility. That big peach tree there has there's an old legend. So Dong Zhuo finally made his move and seized control of Luo Yang. I can't say I'm surprised. People have always talked about him, saying he's more beast than man. It's strange though how he managed to build such a strong army so quickly. That's still the same. Truly, it is a dark time we live in. Perhaps you are one of the yeah, we prefer about that. Okay, first of all, let's have a look at what we got. It's a plus five weapon. Javelin. Gooding blade. I've heard good things about this weapon, in particular the thunderous impact. Oh, it's also part of a set. Sustainability spirit gain from deflecting. Hmm. Oh, it's also metal. Mm-hmm. 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 Maybe I want to lock this one in because I can't remember what. Our other one had. Uh, but this, the dragon's spear. Yeah, you know, the other one that we just got might be better than the one we had before. Keep that. Let's keep this. Sure. We got an actual five colored cudgel. Battle strike damage deflects spirit consumption. Attack spirit damage. Although it comes with this, so no. Not something that I would want. I think I don't even have to look at anything that is below a three star. Probably not gonna use it. Oh, actually, yeah, I think the uh, orange text special effects are actually always on that, and the white ones are you know, interchangeable. I finally found out how that is probably working.
We just target Greaves, those are... But oh, did we get a whole set? We don't have the helmet. Because of course we don't have the helmet. Or do we? Because I think that would actually be a set that I would like to wear. Again, has to be three star or higher. Increase the spirit gain from attacking. I mean, it would be great if I could get the whole set going there. But I don't have the helmet. Gonna keep set items at the three stars or higher. And I'd only kinda keep normal items if they are four star or higher. Or non set items, I should say. It's being a theme, right, that I get these sets but not the helmet. I don't actually like that. <laughs> yeah. Bioface spell, spirit consumption, uh, damage taken in perfect condition, uh -huh. cup of intention. Uh -huh. I think mine is still better. Not only speaking about the upgrade level, but... We could probably change these, but... Yeah, normal attack's pretty good, though. Other damage is useless now. Hmm. Oh well, let's just keep them for now. And one day make something of it. Do it sustainability, luck, HP, water. I mean, luck is good. As a spirit sustainability, I suppose. But it's just nice to have the HP recovery upon deflection coupled with gaining haste upon HP recovery. It's just a really nice combo, I think. So keep that going. So really, actually really hard to find better accessories for me at this point. <sighs> I could use some more sleep. Maybe I'm overworking. Oh, but, 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 but. Can't change my weapon. The gooding blade, right?
Yeah, that's eight got ace getting now. Very nice. But of course we can upgrade this without any additional cost again. Just the best. Actually. I want this because of the more luck. I mean, fire face spells, spirit consumption is eh? Turning key does upon death is just myth. Stone resistance? I don't know. Divine beast gauge gain? Yeah. And the dragon scoop part of recovery? Sure. But luck. to have and then I can salvage everything else that's a bit of stuff lightning enchant Still not sure about embedding them. Like, why can't I select more? Can't just immediately decorate it or something else. All right then. How does this look? Well, at least it looks a little bit better, I suppose. Yeah, can chase. Looking as it does. Do so, so they have to remove the decorations first before you are allowed to do another decoration? And that's why. That doesn't. That doesn't go. Ah, why does this not give you a? You know. Preview of how it's gonna look. Hmm. We're looking for something that isn't as imposing as the normal thingy there, but also looks good. That look was kind of okay. 
I just don't like the cape. This one looks a little bit ridiculous. And fun. Yeah, I guess we can spot this one for a little bit. All right, cool. Also, we can talk to the lady about um, her husband returning, I suppose. Uh, you see, where did I put it? Yeah, I don't know, lady. But missing a goddamn key. <laughs> I know you have something for me. Hmm. Ah, yes. I see. Whoa. Wow. You really are good at finding these tablets. Hmm? I'm becoming more and more devoted to reading them. Hong Jing's one of the finest Taoists here these days. It's no wonder Master trusts her so. Being stuck in this boring village makes me so antsy. I wonder what cities are like. I want to visit one someday. According to my tablets, <coughs> they're supposed to be extremely lively. Oh, not the ones that we've seen. Master says that we're not ready to leave the village. I can't even find things to read without asking for help from others. Master says that we're not... I can't even... I presume you're an accomplished warrior, yet... Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Oh, that reminds me, we haven't given that guy his uh, shells in a while, have we? Go ahead and do that real quick. Hi. You found them! Come on, hand them to me! I don't even know how many I have. Oh. More. I need more. 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 Ooh. A bit of an odd guy, aren't you? Nice one. Oh yeah, those are some good abilities. Hmm. Well, it's guys with fire. Potentially better than what I have. Same with this one. Just scaling with the wrong stuff. Just not. Lock these ends. Because they do look pretty good. And are potentially usable. appreciate the help the other day. You should have seen how delighted my wife was. Another errand from my wife. I'll be back soon. Another errand. I'll be back soon. You remember that detox jerky I was talking about? Well, my husband managed to find some for me, so I got to taste it. Unfortunately, it was too exotic to huh. go along with the liquor. I'm thinking about making a flavored liquor with a fine aroma. And I hear rumors about the oil of awakening, which has oil a pleasant of awakening. smell. I'll ask my husband to get some for me out there. The liquor turned out very nicely. Care for a taste? I thought it didn't. Huh? My husband? 
Oh, no, no, no. He can't take a whiff of alcohol without falling into a drunken stupor. <laughs> These truly are dark times. All I can do is make liquor and believe that I'm doing a little something to relieve people's worries. I'm thinking about making a flavored liquor with the f and I hear rumors about I'll ask my husband. We have all of awakening. Yep, we do. Stone resistance. Oh well, okay. If I ever find that guy out and about again. Yes, I can just give it to him. Oh look, our friend is gone. Because he's dead. Alright, anyway. I guess there's everything for now. Oh wait, there's one more thing I get to check. Uh, was it by who have we got? We already have that. Metal face spell spirit consumption. Uh huh. It's plus spirit damage. Damage amplification. Don't fatal strike. Sounds better than what we have. Right? Oh. Huh? By who? This is working better for my um build, so to speak, at the moment. Cool. All right, Tyrant's final banquet. What are we waiting for? I thought is built a formidable defense for Shang'an. It was there that Dong Zhao retreated with a sword of elixir to plan his next move. That is when the situation in the Guangzhou region changes. Hong Jing has managed to slip past the guards and has a fort alone. He's still in serious danger. He must hurry to the rescue. Let's go and do it. I have fought Fufeng Commandery Sili Province. The middle fortress Zhang Zhao had constructed in Mei County, 250 leagues west of Chang'an. Zhang Zhao brought his clan here in 1992. After sacking Luo Yang and anointing Chang'an as the new capital. With walls over 20 meters in height and width, and a lavish palace inside, it is called Fort Invincible, and rivals even the Grand Air of Chang'an. Its storehouses are stocked with enough military supplies to last 30 years. Peel palace treasures taken from Luo Yang and Chang'an, and Zhongzhou's prized cache of elixir. Damn! Can I hold out a siege for 30 years? Eeks. I came here with Hong Jing as we continued our search for Elixir. I don't know what her plan was, but she has entered the fort alone. I would like you to sneak in, find her, and bring her back. Damn. Do that alone, though? Uh, reinforcements. Can't summon him. Or her. You're a new. And you too. Chink Poo. Wong Guy. But shall young conqueror. Mm. 
martial arts damage isn't so bad. I think I want to bring you along. To battle. I mean, again, like I said, we have to increase our oath for these guys anyway. At one point or another. So why wait? Because of shit like that. I mean, I was pretty certain that there was an enemy around here somewhere. So we could just sneak up on that guy so easily, but... I didn't really take my own advice to heart here, did I? path right until there ah come on That my or the backstab doesn't kill them. Tanky dudes. What? So? Oh. Oh. Okay. That's not good. Oh wow. You deal way too much damage up there, you know that? Figured.
Can I? Thank you. Manic water. Oh, hello. Okay, they. Oh, but I was still able to backstab him if I hadn't messed that up. Because he hadn't seen me. That is good to know. I guess that is uh, the negative side of that particular attack. Control. Very quickly. I have actually managed to do it. How <clears throat> oh, do we get them there? Over there? One would believe so. Simply from here. Yep. Do the trick, I guess. Okay. E is the. Dude. 
Hey, Panda. Of course. Oh, God, that frickin' wolf. Still alive, it is. Jesus. And a bit, uh, nee. That you can't log on to enemies that are outside of the screen. Uh, I have not. I know about it. Um, but I don't think it ever released in Europe. But I really wanted to play it as a kid. And then, uh, you know, as I got older, I forgot about it. And then I rediscovered it through speedrunning because um, John Ford, I think is his name, speedrun it, speedruns it. And I saw it doing a marathon at one point. So, you know, I remember the game. And then I promptly forgot about it again until I saw him run it again in another marathon. And then I forgot it again until you brought it up again. <laughs> So, yeah, the tale with me and Hagane is a tale of remembering and forgetting over and over. <laughs> because I am very interested in that game. Absolutely. Especially, you know, as you just said, I have played Moonrider now. Where I discovered that I don't totally suck at platformers. Is it only 15 minutes? I mean, it might be. I thought it was closer to 20 or something, but I, you know, I guess it depends on who runs it and, you know, how the run goes, I suppose. But yeah, I do know it's a pretty short run, which is kind of nice, actually. I think I'm definitely interested in running another shorter game, seeing as I just, you know, picked up Ishii, which is a four hour run. And potentially picking up this as well, which is another three hour or so run, so... You know, diversifying the game, or the lengths of the games that you run. Definitely interested in doing that. Oh my god, this is gonna be a situation, isn't it? Hey, Dorian! <laughs> oh, you know, I do speedrun Moonrider, and I think I'm not terrible at it. Only four people have a near or more than 20 minutes? Oh, really? Huh. 20 minutes. 14.30. Jesus. Okay, yeah, that is way faster than I thought it would be. Hello. Oh, you know what I should actually do? Try this one up. Ah, fuck. Let's get the same idea, buddy. You know, this sword is pretty nice, actually. I mean, this martial art is basically the sword version of this, right? Kind of has the same energy to it, I think. And John will agree. Six years ago, well, that's the mission was too. Oh. Any percent is one minute twenty. <laughs> okay, that's a bit of a shorter run. You know what? Maybe I should actually just go ahead, grab an emulator, and start playing that game. Hello. Because good luck getting the original SNES cartridge and then hooking the SNES up to a capture card. I mean, it's possible. But goddamn money. Um. Hello, sir. Die?
I think the best decision that I made in this game was to switch my weapons out. Like, don't get me wrong, I love the... I forgot its name again. What was it called? Uh, the pole arm for now. But, um... This Ursine mace is... Or Ursin? Ursine? Ursin? It's just way too good. Like, holy shit. Love this weapon. So have I... gotten everything around here? I think I'm missing something. I guess I am. Oh, wait. I just saw something. Wait, how do I? Oh, there. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I changed my build to be more metal instead of uh, earth. So metal is my uh, preferred element at the moment. I'm like a heavy metal guy. <laughs> Get it? Because I'm heavily invested in metal. I'm heavy metal. I also listen to metal, so. <laughs> okay. This is starting to look not as nice. Kinda interest you in dying. Kinda? Oh my god. There we go. So I guess don't stand in the purple soup. What does standing in the purple soup do? Okay, it saps my spirit. Yeah, figured. <clears throat> Don't stand in purple soup, guys. It doesn't do you good. Nah, but does it good. You know what? Once I'm done with Wolong, done as in I have completed my casual playthrough, somebody remind me about Hagane again, in case I should forget. Cause that's kinda, you know, sounds like a nice palette cleanser after this. As at first, you know, casual playthrough. And then we can see about maybe speedrunning it? Cause why not? Oh, other side. Alright. Oops, of course. Um... Should we go down there or over here? Let's go over here first. <clears throat> I mean, I haven't seen a speedrun of this game yet, but for some reason, I think that they use this attack. But this martial art quite a bit as soon as they can get their hands on it because goddamn is it good okay so this is actually a dead end
It just wrecks them. with the raid hello the castle varies <laughs> how you doing buddy everybody i hope you had fun with kaz and more resident evil 4 remake as i've seen you play a little bit where did that go how are you guys doing actually kaz what time is it in your time zone at the moment like I know, you know, with Australia, it's quite, it's probably Friday evening already, but, uh, what time is it actually over at your place? Also, thank you, Super for the follow. Much appreciated. You about to go to 10 p.m.? Okay, so you are seven hours ahead of me. That is good to know. You know, I just like to have a reference of when people are streaming and what time zones they are, uh, what time zones they are in. So knowing that you are about seven hours ahead of me is like good info to have. It's just my curiosity slated, I guess. But yeah, we are making our or our way through Wolong. It's my first playthrough of the game, released a little bit earlier this month. Uh, it's basically you know Dark Souls, but. Uh, feudal China. Normally I use samurai speedrun games, but I guess China is close enough to Japan to count as a samurai game, right? At least that is how I see it. I mean, these people are just Chinese samurai as far as I'm concerned. I'm probably pissed off a lot of people by saying that, but here we go. <laughs> go back one hour on Sunday. Oh, so you will be six hours ahead of me then. All right, no worries. Oh, it was not just an EST, he was up all night. <laughs> oh no. Well, welcome on in to you as well then. It's always you know, funny to see where people are watching from. Or at what time they actually watch streams. I mean... I, again, I will, I will probably piss off a lot of people if I, if I define a samurai. But uh, think of them as Japanese knights, as I think the closest you can get if you don't, if you know absolutely nothing about them. But whatever constituted a knight in Europe is probably just a samurai in Japan. And so, again, that statement probably pissed a lot of people, <laughs> but that is how I'm gonna define it for now. <laughs> I'm off to bed and I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> well, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of funny. But, you know, everybody has their own rhythm to their days and whatnot. Again, it's just curiosity when, when people are doing their stuff. Also, these are a lot of enemies that would have dropped on me have I gotten down there or gone down there before coming up here. Also, who puts this flag in this? I don't even know what this is. A cage? Whatever. Um, well, it, it depends. Like, the mercenaries were more like the Ronin that didn't have a lord that they were serving. Because the, the samurai, you know, that the, the, like, had a little um, provinces or whatnot that they were supposed to have a look over. But obviously that got, you know, throw down the shitter. When um, the samurai kind of, I don't want to say got disbanded, but when the uh, political system in Japan changed. And that is where they become more like mercenaries because, you know, they didn't have a lord anymore that they were serving that was paying them. So they had to go and, you know, get money somehow else. And that is when they kind of started becoming mercenaries. But that was later um, in the years. Like again, 
I would, I would say close to the end of the Tokugawa Shogunate. Unless I have my history completely messed up right now. Nah, not a paladin. Like, they weren't a holy people. Like, if you were to talk paladins, that would more that would be more like the monks, uh, like actually working in the monasteries. I mean, I'm not saying that they weren't religious, the samurai, but uh, I don't think they were paladins. Well, there you go. Dorian with the Wikipedia drop, I suppose. I see the 1870, which is, you know, the funny thing, because when we played uh, Like a Dragon Eastern, right, that was set during the period where the uh, samurai basically got abolished. Um, because that game ties into the Meiji Restoration, where the Imperial Court was back to ruling Japan instead of the Shogunate. Because Japan had been uh, ruled by the Shogun, which is like a military leader, for a couple hundred years after, you know, Oda Nobunaga tried to unify Japan. Kind of failed, kind of succeeded. Well, he himself failed, but then his successors... Um, oh god, what was the name again? Hideyori... Hideyori... something something. Blanking on the name right now. He managed to do it, but then he was overthrown by the Tokugawa. Iyasu Tokugawa, and then Japan was under Tokugawa rule for 300 years? 400 years? <clears throat> uh. But yeah, you know, eventually things got bad, and um, the Shogunate got overthrown because people were fed up with it. Because people actually want to see the Emperor rule his land again. Oh god. I'm just messing up because I like to talk about samurai too much. Alright, give me a second here. Next time you need a helping hand, I'll be there. Yeah, that is kinda how that all came to be. Jade Echoes run 80% glitches is 4 hours, work is 330. Oh my god. I still haven't played Chained Echoes. Like it's on the list. Also shoutouts to Panda for gifting me the game for my birthday last month. And can you believe I get a game gifted to me on my birthday and I haven't been able to play it yet because other games. Shake my hand. Yeah, like the Meiji era was definitely an interesting time for Japan, you know, also with the influence of the outside world because uh, a couple of years earlier Japan opened its borders again for other countries because they have been, they had been very isolationist, which has made them fall behind in industry and everything. So there was a lot of political pressure going on there and like Britain especially tried to colonize Japan. Like they did with a lot of other countries. Kind of failed, though. All right, guys, no worries. Thank you so much for the raid. Much appreciated. Have a good dinner and a look. And I guess I'll see you around. Well, I very carefully engage in this two-legged crocodile thing with a very, very pointy tail. Oh my god, that, that thing is a chad. Also, I mean, you know, it kind of looks very menacing, but also kind of cute because it has such a short body. <laughs> it's like... It's a very interesting enemy design in my book. Ah, God! Ah, oh, shit, it didn't notice me. Uh, well, that kind of threw my... Uh, what's the word? Oh, hey, since I was actually doing work here. I'm gonna throw my backstep plan. Oh, god. Backstep plan to jeopardy.
Oh god. Ah shit. Ah shit. Oh, we are fighting in the purple stuff. Don't fight in the purple stuff. We've learned that earlier. And this thing is just relentless. Yeah, I don't know how to fight these things properly just yet. Which is why this thing is giving me a bit of a headache. Okay. Oh, hey. Made it without dying, and we get to feed a panda. Well, it's not really a panda, it's a sheety show. It's a colorful panda. Oh, that's still kind of cute. Okay, so what do I have for you to eat? I guess this guard pole axe will do. Oh, huh, huh, huh. I don't want to feed it a four star. Let's just go with a three star. It's good enough, I guess. Yeah, they are kind of cute, right? You just give them items to eat, and then they poop out other items for you to use. I mean, look at him. Adorable. Then he goes to sleep. He's so yawny. Uh, well. <laughs> Sleepy panda. <laughs> uh, Jade Empire. Uh, well, Jade Empire, what was that? That uh, Bioware RPG thing? Because the name rings a bell, but... Dragon Vein Essence, yes, please. Like me some Dragon Vein Essence. Um, is there anything around here? All right, give me just a second here. Yeah, okay, I got that one. I have a, a collectible guide open just so I don't miss anything because, oh my god. Collectibles are the bane of my existence and I hate having to come back to uh, levels just to collect those stuff because it's kind of hard keeping track of some of them. I mean, the game has just received an update today that actually makes it visible which collectibles you have gotten in a, in a level, which is pretty nice. Neo already had that. I have no idea why they didn't do it from the, uh, for this game from the beginning. But uh, hey, here we are. Oh, RPG, it's two hours, really? <laughs> English Ben has run it? Wait, I thought Ben only did like GTA and stuff. What the hell? But wait, what, wasn't that like an Xbox exclusive or something? Because I don't think it will, I've ever seen it on the PlayStation system, have I? Oh my god. How did I fail that deflect game? Is that, that, that for me? Ah. X I mean... Yeah, with everything that is on Xbox, it will ultimately come to PC as well. So, you know, if I say Xbox exclusive, in my mind, that kind of uh, encompasses PC releases. But I guess that is not necessarily always the case. Because, I mean, you know, Xbox is Microsoft, PC is Microsoft, so, yeah. Kind of the same thing in my head, I guess. Even though not 100% accurate. But, uh, what I wanted to say is, it explains why I never played it. What I was trying to get at. Wait, which is Tiger Helmet? Oh, heck yeah. That is the last set piece that we needed. So I can actually go ahead and put on the whole armor set now if I wanted to. Ah. Ah. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> Oh, hello. 
This looks different. Oh, well, I mean, you know, everybody needs a palette cleanser at some point, I suppose. You were a bit dumb, aren't you? I mean, apparently my NPC companion is dumber still, but... <laughs> so that's third place? Jeez. Um, okay, so let me actually check. Ah! You know, even though I could equip the whole... S Wait, what? How does this have more defense than my plus six helmet? But then again, this is only a two star. <sighs> like I will lose. Okay, what do I lose? I lose the morale rank points gain, which is nah. Fire phase, I don't care about. Luck, I do care about. I got armor. Plus a bit of HP, it doesn't matter. Spirit damage received, yeah. Fireface spell, spirit consumption. Hmm, that's a great damage taken, perfect condition, okay. Copper obtention, yeah, okay. But it was out on even more luck. And spirit damage received. Generating key obtention, yeah. Lightning damage, hmm. Or rank points gain, yeah. But it do get elemental resistance. Would face spell, spirit consumption would be nice. And shooting weapon damage is again, yeah. And we lose even more luck. Positive effect duration. F. How much luck do I have? 109. Yeah, I would lose out on all of that. But then again, we are not really farming for equipment right now. Okay, let's put it off until we finish this mission so I can actually go ahead and upgrade um, that armor sent. And then we'll have a look see this. Because it actually does sound good. Like, you know, the set bonus and everything. I kind of do want to wear that set if only, you know, it had better effects on it god damn it oh hello uh where did he run off to oh kind of see him back there yeah there he comes <laughs> he took the long way around ow Drip before rip. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. It's a hard. Maybe. But I get where you're coming from. Well, there's a bit of a situation. Going again something soon? Oh, it's or can I just call it Azzy? I think that's kinda easier to pronounce. Thanks so much for watching, no worries. Have a good rest day, whatever it is you're gonna do. Guys, it's fine? Alright, nice. And I guess I will see you soon. Happy weekend. Soon, I hope. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna shoot you in the head. That will drop... Or not drop, draw. Both of you. And then I will just murder you. And then I can go ahead and kill your ex-companion. Oh! Sonte actually took care of that other guy. I right, know I butchered that name totally. But here we are. Oh. So now I can sneak up on you, can't I? Ah, no, I cannot. 
health. I took that straight to the face. Not that one, though. Well, that other thing was right in the kisser. Oh, hello. I mean, we could co-op this if we were on PlayStation Panda. <laughs> Rain is going sideways. Jesus. <clears throat> you know, whenever I hear things like that, it always reminds me back when I was in the military. Uh, because they kept saying it isn't rain until it's going straight into your face, you know, like at a 90 degree angle. Only then can it be called rain. And I thought it was kind of funny. Also, what the fuck are you? Ah, God, he was able to parry that? What a Chad. What a Chad. Wait, wasn't there an enemy here? Oh, there he is. No, no. That was the wrong button, I swear. I wanted to use the healing art. Ah, well. <laughs> I mean, I guess... Um, uh, what's it called again? Dark Tide is still... a uh, possibility. I don't have any arrows anymore. Oh shit. But I guess before I start playing Dark Tide, I will wait for a sale or something. Oh shit. There we go. Yeah, he does have two of them. As you can see there. Which is a very interesting weapon choice, I gotta admit. Because the thing was, when I first read that, uh, you know, there was a two or a weapon type where you will two halberds, I thought they would be full length and I was very confused. Because wielding two full length halberds at once. That is, uh, okay. But now he wields two short ones. Or oh, I'd say weapon type which has you wield two short hobbits which is pretty nice it does doesn't fit my playstyle slash build yes the thingy thing there was something down here wasn't that yeah, there we go dragon wing crystal me all the dragon wing crystals thank you i love me some dragon wing crystals Tonfas. Oversized halberd. Uh, I mean, I can kind of see that as um, replacement. Oh, damn. Oh, hello. Ah, uh, because I'm supposed to reach you a little bit later. Are you looking in my direction? Well, you should be, because otherwise you're dead. He did it. I mean, this looks like a trap. But I guess it wasn't. Alright. Fair enough. 
I mean, it was kind of a Chad. Very much did not like see him die in the game. Little Conqueror. <laughs> ah! I'd actually pay attention to the game, shouldn't I? Smaller settlements, floor thing. But, you know, imagine being like a quote-unquote flawless warrior, right? And then being called the Little Conqueror. I mean, by your explanation, I get where the name is coming from, but god damn. <laughs> I guess that also was a no small, um, you know, poke at his father being larger than him. Or more well-known or whatnot. Damn. The Little Conqueror. Why is there so much open space here with no enemies? Kind of confuses me. There's a whole lot of nothing around here. Oh, hello. Can I? I cannot. Here's my bait. <laughs> he took the bait. <laughs> I'll literally lose the little conqueror as my bait. Bait out this enemy. <clears throat> Crash entire castle by its side. Jesus. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is this all the way back at the beginning of the mission? It is. Oh, holy fuck. Yeah, we made the full circle now. I totally forgot that this door existed. Oh. Uh... Wow, so the whole cavern and bamboo garden thing could have been skipped if you could have just opened this door right here. Jesus. I mean, that, that is the sensible thing to do, right? How do I get on top of that to grab this? I have to f go the other side of the wall first. I think that's actually a very smart thing of him to do. Oh, hello. Wait. Wasn't this thing a boss earlier? That is that boar again, isn't it? Can I sneak up on it? I cannot. Oh, God. I never was good at dodging that attack, or deflecting it rather. That one though. I'm not dying here. No way. Don't get trapped. Ah, that was so soon. Yeah, uh, where is he? There he is. That's a double charge. Ah, that 
fake out. Oh fuck. Did he go for a third one? No. I always deflect when his hind legs touch the ground instead of his front legs. Oh. How did that not work? Haha. <laughs> Got you this time, bastard. What did I just say? Yeah, that was worse than it could have been. Unbeaten Conqueror. Well, I guess at least he was able to shed the name of the small Conqueror, so good on him. <laughs> good on him, indeed. <clears throat> but I am making towards... making my way towards the end of the mission. Let's see here, another rank 6 steel, which is nice. So I guess the end of the mission is uh, right in here. Still missing quite a few marking flags though. There's another one. Still means I am missing one somewhere after that one. Oops. Does it again immediately? What? Yeah. I always forget about him exploding. Okay, so there's one more marking flag somewhere. Two tigers? Oh, one tiger. That was awfully quick. Someone saw me then. Wait, he became straight up deified? Okay. It looks like the marking flag could be back there. Oh, 
Hello. I will be old and grey until I learn how to deflect their attacks. Because goddamn cannot make sense of it. Can I just shoot you in the head? Okay. Yeah, but it seems like I missed a marking flag somewhere. Oh, hello. Why did you not attack like at all, buddy? I jump up here. Oh, hello. Then again, it looks like we're not quite done here yet. Not that guy in particular, but the enemy type. Oh, there it is. Hey, found it. Nice. Okay, but how do I get up there? Two meter tall giant? Interesting. Yeah, so how do I get up there? Ah, okay. That was easier than I thought it would be. Also, did those guys AI bug out or something? Because they didn't attack me like at all while I was down there. Maybe I just very sneakily evaded them. Uh, I guess we have a boss fight coming up. So, more metal. We're going all heavy metal in here, as always. Uh, I guess we're good to go. <clears throat> Do this. I'm actually going to phase... Dong Zhao. Dong Zhao. Oh, is it going to be Lu Bu again? <clears throat> You've messed up my entertainment. In that case. I shall just have to improvise. With your dying screams. How about yours? Oops. Your screams will be music to my ears. Let's begin the performance. Oh my god, I cannot make sense of his attacks.
Oh my god, they are so delayed. It's just always faking me out. What even was that? Like I hate it when the, the when the um attacks have such a weird timing. So I guess we have to take this a little bit slower now. That kick is just... I just... These timings are just bullshit. Um, I mean, I guess the health bar is pretty easy enough to explain, right? It's the green one. <laughs> Beneath that is your spirit bar. And it starts in the middle. And it can go either to the right when it will be blue. Or it can go to the left one will be red. Um, so again, it can go to plus 1000 or minus 1000. Whenever you use like a martial art or a spell, that will cost a certain amount of spirit. Like this. Yeah. That costs 630 spirit to use. I am now on the left side. Um, if I go to minus 1000, I will get stunned for a little while where I cannot block or take any action. Uh, also, when I try to deflect, that also costs uh, spirits just like that, so we'll always go into the negative. I gain spirit by landing attacks or properly deflecting. And the same is true for the enemy. Basically, what I want to do is you want to try to be on the defensive and deflect until you've basically staggered your enemy and then go for like a fatal blow. Generally speaking. Or, you know, you want to try and have your spirit in the positive in order to use your abilities and not be staggered yourself. Actually... Okay. Running. So I wanna, you know, try to deplete his spirits so it's on the far left side so he gets staggered then I can then get a yeah th these attacks and because they deal a lot of damage as you just saw and I do that by properly deflecting and uh, you know landing attacks myself oh he doesn't want that Yeah, that was such a good idea. Oh, he does it again immediately, huh? Oh, shit. Oh, wow. It goes on for a while. Yeah. Great camera work there. Because I couldn't see shit. What the fuck? How did I lose so much life there all of a sudden? Jesus Christ. Because I should have used another death counter for this game, shouldn't I? Begin the perform. 
Eat that fucking kick. This one is easy enough to deflect. Oh, did not pay attention to that attack. Same mistake as last time. Don't try to punish that one. I just see a physical PS5 copy is gonna come out at some point with all the DLCs. Yeah, that is um, probably a fair assumption. But it is a very good game. I highly enjoy it. I mean, if you're specifically waiting for a physical copy, yeah, obviously hold off. But I'm pretty sure there will also be a digital version of it with all the DLCs included, like, I don't know, next year or so. So unless you really want to play it now, um, just wait for, you know, the complete edition. Because I cannot see this game not getting one, right? Okay, there we go. Ah, god. Yeah, okay, he got me there. Yeah, that was just bullshit. <laughs> Oh my god, that is a lot of games. Fourth language? Jesus. No worries there, it's totally understandable. To be fair, I switched to mostly digital with a PlayStation 4, I think it was. Oh my god. What? Do it again, you bastard.
I always panic a little bit when I see that attack for some reason. Huh? I was too close that time. Oh, come on. That is just bullshit. He just likes to prioritize the attacks that I have problems deflecting. And the double with that attack is just bullshit. Couldn't affect that because I was still drinking. <sighs> Maybe I should switch my weapon. I thought so. I thought that, uh, oh wait, you thought that Neo 1 and 2 was harder than finishing everything. Yeah, Elden Ring was pretty easy, I thought, actually. Also, uh, out of the three, Neo 1, 2, and Elden Ring, I thought Neo 1 was probably the hardest. Like, Neo 2 was not a very hard game, in my opinion, either. Like, with the whole, uh, what was it called, Spirit Burst mechanic. Oh, that please. Eh. Right back at you, buddy. Okay. Guess we just stood on that attack some reason. I could do nothing there. The effect just didn't happen. What the fuck?
I mean, sure, if you start, um, you know, ignoring game mechanics, uh, then obviously things can be harder or easier depending on which mechanic you ignore. Just like not using the, you know, spirits or the, um, I forgot what they were called in Neo 2. They were called the Spirit Ashes and, uh, oh my god. I should stop talking when I'm fighting a boss. <laughs> and if you just start uh, not using game mechanics, like, obviously it's gonna be harder. No worries. Does that mean I can't use it because you beat a boss on the first try? Why? Exactly, Dorian. Exactly. What is this bullshit? Like, there is like no attack reaction when you stand in that trolley spare thing that just absolutely shreds your HP bar. I would disagree with that, actually. It's like, you know, if you intentionally make a game harder on yourself and then get stuck on something, well, that's on you. Like, sure, the whole get good thing might come into play, but... I mean, do what you want, you know? If that makes you happy beating your head against the wall for thousands of times and being able to beat a boss because you're know, using all the game's mechanics that it affords you, I mean, sure. Go ahead and do that. Personally, I don't see the point. Other than, you know, getting fame on the internet or something. Because at that point you're just making your life miserable by your own decisions. timing for that fatal blow If it does that, then it will be the trolley thing. Got it. Uh, yeah. Can't get the fatal blow if you do that. So I shouldn't have done that. Oh my god. Yeah, should have. Then the camera on that one. Okay, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Why 
why isn't it right if you beat every boss with summons on the first try? If you're just using the game's mechanics. Again, I don't see a problem with that. You don't have to fail over and over again against the boss fight. I mean, if you are learning, you know, if the game keeps getting harder, and it is, you know, especially in these type of games, but you still overcome it like first try, you are just, you know, slightly above the learning curve. Obviously, if you've played more of those games too, you know, obviously that will come easier for you. Like if you played all the Dark Souls games and its permutations, like, you know, Neo and whatnot, and then you play Elden Ring or another game in the genre, and you beat everything first try, it's just made you spend a lot of time in the genre already. So why should you fail? You know, you have that experience. You can adapt. Yeah, <laughs> running into the water and stuff like that and just outright killing you. Oh my god, that happens so often to me as well. It's a bit of bullshit, not gonna lie. I think I died more often to environments than I died to the bosses in year 2 specifically. Oh yeah, uh, Radagon and the Elden Beast. Like, that is a deadly combination. Like, Radagon... Uh, specifically. I mean, yeah. I can get that uh, the whole, you know, Spirit Ashes thing was maybe them reacting to more people wanting to play that game and making it easier for them uh, if you have companions. I, I get that. Don't get me wrong there. But, uh... I mean, th th there are valid arguments for both sides of the discussion here, I think. And at the end of the day, play what you want and how it makes you happy, I'd say. I mean, I'm not going to fault you for trying it, you know, the quote-unquote normal way without using uh, companions and whatnot. Absolutely not. The thing that uh, just... You know, and, and I'm not saying that you have said that or you have done that. It's just when people say that, oh my god, Elden Ring is so hard and they die, I don't know, often against any boss and then you see him just not make use of the game mechanics and I'm like, they're like, huh? Why are you not using X and Y? And then it's like, oh yeah, I'm not using that because it makes too easy, you know, the game to be hard and then they complain that the game is hard and I'm just like, they're like, what? Like, what? what is it you're trying to achieve there? You know, why are you complaining about the game being hard if you've specifically made it hard on yourself? You know, th th that is just the argument that I do not understand. All right. Again, not saying that that was something that you were doing specifically. It's just I've seen a lot of people argue in that kind of space, and it, I just don't understand it. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> I get that. It's just, yeah, the, the internet can be a wild place. Like, to be fair, I never really understood the oh my god, Dark Souls is so hard argument. Uh, because when I played Dark Souls, obviously I struggled a little bit, but not nearly as much as people were you know, marketing it to me. I'm not saying I'm a god at Dark Souls or anything, it's just... These, game be, these games being all so hard is kind of overrated to me. And again, there are way better uh, players of this genre out there than me. Also, oh my god, can you? Why did that deal damage to me? See, you know what? I'm an idiot. Because I can't just block and fucking block his attacks as well. I totally keep forgetting about the block in this game. I always want to deflect everything. Which, don't get me wrong, is the better choice at the end of the day, but... My god. Just block some attacks.
Like that bullshit. Okay, I think I finally have the timing down for that one. Why did that not get deflected? Oh, these are poisoned, are they? That is why I'm losing health here. Blocking. Just fucking block some attacks, you doofus. Talking to myself here. It has played on my mind ever since I saw you at Wulaguan Pass. But how could I forget how bravely you always held yourself? So, brother, why? Why do you stand with Dong Zhuo? Brother, you mistake me for another. Uh, so I will get to your chat messages in a second. An Just assassin. give me a second here. Your tongue will perfect timing. You shall make a fine soldier. <laughs> Literal backstabbing. How dare you? You would betray me. Very well. The elixir is yours, Lubu. <sighs> Literal backstab. <laughs> Why does his backstab deal so much more damage than mine, though? <laughs> Go before things get out of hand. Brother! Don't worry about me. Chong Liao, take her away. Time to leave. <laughs> Please, wait! <sighs> what will he do with the elixir? I simply follow General Liu's orders. Please, this way. You. you saved me yet again. I had to make sure. But at last I'm convinced. About what? <laughs> oh, that's a brother, I guess. He was the person I always wanted to be like to catch up to and then he left without a farewell i need to know why he set his sights on the elixir otherwise i'll never be able to get things back to normal 
seeing you fearlessly face up to the demonic tea has given me determination. It may take force to get the truth out of him. But there's no one he would tell other than me. And this thing kind of looked like a unicorn, but not really. I will never give up. For when it comes to being stubborn, even my brother cannot best me. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> to think he survived. I... I hope the day will come when we can train together once more. Guess that is why Lu Bu is such a chad. Because he trained with that guy. All right. I'd say yeah, YouTubers kind of trick the audience because so, you know sensationalism and such. After defeating Dong Zhuo, Lu Bu took the elixir and turned his back to the fort. Because it gets your views. The elixir was now in the hands of the strongest warrior in the entire land. Cao Cao, fearing what Lu Bu might be capable of, deployed Cao Cao. his forces to bring him down. However, he lost Cao Cao? Lu Yang to his adversary and found himself on the back foot as Lu Bu's forces struck back. Make way! Yo, are they using actual stone tablets as shields? We must retake Puyang! You're fighting well, but stay sharp! You are young! You live up to your name, Lu Bu. Is this all the great Cao Cao can muster? <laughs> Gonna fight him again? Hold back for now. <clears throat> I guess you won't. <laughs> Just immediately abandoning orders. Shall we run? Alright. Got anything to say? I am Jun Yu, General Cao's advisor. Initially, Colonel Shaho was tasked with defending Puyang City. However, it was assaulted by Lu Bu while he was away, and it was taken. Now he has returned and making considerable efforts to recapture the city. I only pray that the elixir supposedly held by Lu Bu's army does not invite foreseen circumstances. Foreseen? Please catch up to him and provide some support if possible. I shall join with General Cao once the troops are ready. May you fight well. Please catch up. I shall join. May you fight well. I don't mind having you with us, as long as you pull your weight. Yeah, yeah. Well, let's go back to the village first. Yes, please. Okay, so I can finally catch up on chat. Oh my god. I think just right now for PlayStation 5. <laughs> no worries, God's a God, love is all here. Thanks for stopping by. And I have fun with the game. My chat could take on all the kingdoms that they went on to form a coalition with just the Battle of Hulog Gate. As far as Red Mare. Oh, really? Ah. Uh... 
I mean, Ryoma in Like a Dragon Ishin wasn't silent. I mean, see, the, the thing is with, um, I think this is like, you know, this series specifically, you know, Neo and now Wo Long. The story takes so much of a backseat to everything else. I don't really care. Because, yes, it follows, you know, um, historical events. Which, like, you know, all, all the battlefields that we go to, these happened historically. And, like, obviously, they embellished the whole thing a little bit with the elixir and the mystical elements and whatnot. And obviously, your character probably wasn't around either. Um, so it's, like, really far out there, far-fetched, if you want. Um, so I really don't mind as much because the story is not the main focus of these type of games. But, you know, this game and the, the Neo series. It's just, it's there so they can say that they have, you know, a story and it can string you along to all these uh, historical battlefields and whatnot. But uh, it's, it's very bare bones. Like it barely even makes sense if you don't know the history behind all of these things. Oh, martial arts damage. Mm. I do like spirit damage more. Yeah, let's get that. Yeah. It's just, uh, it feels like a very incoherent story, you know, in Neo and Wall Long, if you don't know the historical context to it. Because sometimes they just jump eight years ahead, you barely even notice it. Apparently nothing happened during those eight years. Yeah. Everyone here lives each day with such enjoyment. A fruit of Master Dro's virtuous ways, to be sure. I can scarcely wait for the day when the entire state can bask in peace, like the people of this village do. I mean, it's not only theater. Just look at Dark Souls, right? Like, Dark Souls has a lot of story and history. It's just, it's, you have to go through, you know, the item description, or you have to act actively want to engage Ooh, with it in order to get it. I could use some more sleep. Maybe right, because it's mostly in item descriptions and, um, you know, context, like you just said, like where you find items and what happened there and whatnot. But there are barely any you know, cutscenes or anything that actually tell you the story of what the fuck is going on in those How games. Indeed. A settlement isolated from the rest of the world. Which I had once um, discussed several matters with you. But perhaps I would learn more if we were to cross swords. Oh, okay. Uh, which works for Dark Souls because it's a fictional setting in the first place, right? Like they can just make stuff up that would make sense there. It's a little bit different with Neo and Wolong because it actually follows historical events. You know, they can't just make stuff up. I mean, obviously they have with the whole supernatural elements and whatnot. But um, I think it's very hard to tell that story and tell it good. And I don't think they do a good job of it. Like, again, the story is there. It's not terrible, but it's definitely not good, I would say. It's not the main draw, for sure. How splendid indeed. A settlement isolated from the rest of the world. I had one, but perhaps... I definitely like the stories of Dark Souls more because there is more that you discover and learn. Whereas it's mostly spelled out here. Like there is no mystery or anything like that. Uh, in a way, it's just very straightforward. I presume you're an accomplished that makes sense. I don't know if any of what I just said made sense, but I hope it does. You know, he actually does look a little bit like him too, I think. Which is funny. You remember that detox jerk well. 
My husband may unfortunately. Yeah, okay, so you have nothing new to say either. So I guess we just continue on then, huh? Because there's nothing new here anyway. Alright then. Oh yeah, I wanted to check um, the armor, didn't I? I picked up quite a few things along the way. Should have got so plus five. Meteor shower. Oh, it looks like a nice one. Twelve and advance. Okay. I can see myself keeping hold on that. Actually, let's do it like this. Yeah, I guess I will keep both of these for now. Curved Saber, yep, nope. Triumphant Conquest. Hmm. <laughs> Want it for now. If you're not keeping these, Cavalry Javelin. Ah, yeah, no, it's a one star. Never mind. Oh. Four star bamboo crossbow plus three. Oh, they scale with water. Ah. This is from set two. Oh, this is Dong Zhao's set, isn't it? Ah. ah, yeah, maybe. Maybe they just use the same model or something. <laughs> Shout out to lazy devs. Not nah, really. Do I really want to switch that on though? I don't know. See myself holding onto these for a little while. Maybe it is time that I switch my stuff around a little bit. Kind of want to try these two out. Okay, but what do we do here? Mm. I don't have... Uh, uh where is it? Tide Overlord there. What is that? HP, okay. Again, something upon a fatal strike on an enemy. Power drop to enemy on landing fatal strike. Just be for Oh. 
Oh. Oh. Hmm. What do these do again? Okay, you know what? First of all, let's go ahead and uh, dismantle the stuff we don't need, so it's a little bit easier. Oh, you can hear the drilling? Well, yeah, there we go. They are back at it. Yeah, sorry about that, but obviously nothing I can do. My stomach's growling. Guess I best go See, out. See, the thing out. is, I want to wear that set, right? But I also kind of don't want to waste my materials on things that are actually not that great. That makes sense. only the weapons. There we go. Because I would just stick with what I have. Could I ever go ahead and upgrade this? Just make, just get it to, you know, the max level. Oh, shit, no, I don't want to give it immediately. Because this seems like a good one. And then I can just go ahead and, um... Oh, where are the ones that I had equipped? These ones.
Again, why am I not wearing these? Does it have more luck? <laughs> yeah, well, we'll see about if I will have a bias to that as well. I really like my setup at the moment. Okay. Oh, by the way, right. <sighs> I could use some more sleep. Maybe I'm overworking. What else do we have here? Well, this one looks pretty cool. When you could get rid of the cape. This one looks very cool. I like this one. I don't like the cape. Capes. Fate of the Entertainer because we have more stuff to collect there. The Entertainer looked out for Hong Jing while she was infiltrating Mai Wu Fort, disappeared without a trace shortly after promising to escape the fort together. The fort overrun with demons now, her life may be all but forfeit. The girl must be saved for Hong Jing's sake too. The drilling is getting really bad, isn't it? So if the drilling gets too much for you guys, tell me I can just mute myself for a while, I guess. Until they have uh, slowed down again.
Hello, hello. Oh god. They be drilling and they be drilling hard. Very hard, actually. We broke the enemy's formation. Let's keep this up. We might be heading for trouble here. Oh, nice stop for a spell. Probably won't last that long though. Past experiences of any indication. Yep, there we are. Oh my god, how can I not? Is there actually anything I could give you? Because I just yeah, I gotten rid of quite a few things. Yeah, I really haven't found anything worthwhile, but hey, here we go. Hello. Try that again. The 
to drag around the tiger. We made it. Not the oh shit. Let me through, woman. That's a lot of loot. Oh, damn. Oh, hello. Well, this is the way to the boss. Oh, hello. Nothing here. This is literally just a dead end. Okay. Oh, 
both and clearly has the upper hand here. That was her. Oh. Okay. Got it. That was the entertainer. Some reason I just cannot just remember. Oh, hello. Not remember. Uh. Yeah, this was the only one. I can't remember. <laughs> I to navigate the menu. That is what I wanted to say. Yes. That took a while to come out. Oh wait, this is not even the set. I'm not looking at this now. That would be a set. Not. Bullshit. Should uh, increase these at some point. And with increase, I mean upgrade. I do have the Trickerium Punch. You know what? Because apparently these are the only ranged weapons we're gonna get. I could use some more sleep. Maybe I'm overworking. I mean, I have the money, I have the resources. to not upgrade them at least a couple of times, right? Okay. Just to get a little bit more oomph out of them. Because if I have another specific hit in the hit spot, um, the weak point. They do very damage. Okay, anyway. Wars, flames, blaze fiercely. That's about right. Le Bu betrayed Zhang Zhou and took the elixir for, him, elixir for himself. At this time, the Guangdong regionists are already in chaos, but each lot fighting for control. Chao Chao, who is still searching for the elixir despite the trail going cold, surprised by Lu Bu's forces at Puyang and lose control of the city. The chapter in the chaotic age begins with the possession of the elixir, Lu Bu, as a central figure. Possessor of the elixir, Lu Bu, as a central figure. Alright. Puyang Dong Commandery, Yan Province. Puyang is like a north of the Pushui River, a tributary of the Yellow River. It was one of Chao Chao's key bases. The fortified city dating back to the spring and autumn and warring states periods, 
It was buried underground when a massive flood occurred in the middle of the former Han period. A major engineering project in the later Han period brought the Yellow River under control, and cities along the bank, including Puyang, then constructed underground channels for sewage. While it was initially Chao Chao's main base, he felt that its position relative to the Yellow River made it vulnerable and relocated to the North Bank. Oh, the other curse called Hey Bo. Uh, enemy. Looks like the sluice is bound with thick rope. Let's get closer and have a look. Uh, you know what? I'm actually gonna summon another buddy just to, you know, increase our oath levels. So, who should I summon? I actually can't summon a lot of people here. Because they are all grayed out. Cheng Pu, Wang Gai, Song Chan, Song Jie, Hong Jing, or Zhao Yun. Stalwart Tiger or Lead Tiger? Ah, uh, give this guy a try. Oh wow. That is. Yeah, these pronunciations are definitely tripping me up. Like I'm sorry if I'm butchering the names and whatnot, but I'm trying my best here. Okay, try my best. Crocodile enemies. No, 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 no! Absolutely not. If if you notice that I'm pronouncing something incorrectly, do let me know so I can try to make better. I'm just kind of going by what they say in game, but also, um, you know, sometimes I think they get the pronunciations in the game wrong. At least to my understanding. But well, then again, maybe they are right and I am wrong, and I have no idea because obviously I don't speak Chinese. But if you do know how it's pronounced, do let me know and I will try to make better. Okay. Oh, he's level 13? Oh, shit. Oh, 12 now. So where are my homies? Shit. Do you guys want to fight that thing or am I alone in that? Come on, he's nearly down. Oh, but so are we. God damn it. Try that again. We didn't really do a lot of Cheng Pu, did we? <laughs> Fine. I shall accompany you. So let's try doing that again. Oh god. Dude, what the fuck? Why did it not lock on? Yanju. Like it didn't give me the attack thing. That was bullshit. Oh, I also didn't summon Cheng Fu. Cheng Fu? Cheng Fu? What was it? Cheng Fu. Really? 
I thought you couldn't fall down while they were attacking. Wait, does, does that thing come into reach here? That's why not. Also, what is that thing even guarding? Okay, don't think... I don't think I see any item being over there. Am I just making a fool of myself trying to fight that thing? Probably am. No, he doesn't come into reach here. Oh, there is a treasure chest there. Let's see it now. All right, let's try this again. There we go. Where are my buddies? There they are. Of being too shot by an enemy. Ganjing and Moye. Plus five. And a four star at that, too. Uh, let's go with. Ah. Ah, and then spiders. <laughs> Wait, why are there spiders in a damn place like this? So just keep in mind, this was flooded until a minute ago, so why are there enemies here in the first place? I mean, I guess I couldn't understand the zombies and stuff. Eh, and, and her. Somebody else killed the thing that had killed me. I'm gonna say, wait, what? What just happened? Yeah, sorry, but the spiders being down here makes absolutely no sense to me. No sense. Try harder. Did Neo have spiders? I think it did, but I can't clearly remember. Some run of the mill militia mm. Yeah. Can't remember either if it had spiders on. Not that I would want it to have spiders, but. So is he blanking on it right now? Oh, that was everything that was here. Oh, hello.
Hey, Strife. I have big spiders. All right. I really can't remember. I can't remember at all. Oh, yeah, of course it did. Yes, 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 yes. Now I. Oh, of course. Like it even had that whole spider castle thing. Ah, yeah. It's coming back to me now. God damn it, why does it come back to me? <laughs> I, I regret having started this discussion. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, and the spider lady. Yeah, 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 oh my god. God oh, damn it. Jesus. I mean, it takes some mental effort uh, to forget about the whole spider castle thing, doesn't it? Like, you don't just forget about that. Yeah, like, you have to uh, afford some mental effort to actually <laughs> make that memory go away, I think. <laughs> Which be laggy? Okay. But at least the drilling has stopped. Again. For now. Oh, hello. Wait, I deflected that arrow without knowing it was there. There's such a boss gamer. But how do I get up there? I can beat your asses. Well, I guess that works. Ow. Stop hurting me. There we go. Ah, you'd have to go up there first. Alright. Guess we don't have to do that then. So what'll it be, buddy? Turning around like a good, good boy. And an idiot for that matter. Ah, oh, come on, that hit me? Oh, shit. Yukia spider? Nah. I don't think so. If we take the shortcut through that gate, we'll be heading into a tiger's den. Taking the long way around might well be smarter. Ah, here we go. I mean, then again, wait. Wait, the Yuki was that one boss, right? The big thing? Yeah. Mm. I don't know. I mean, not, not that I think about it, maybe. It is a spider adjacent. Some dumb shit like that. Yeah. I was confusing the Gyuki with um, the the Minotaur kind of looking enemy that you know that to find in the first mission. I'm blanking on their name as well right now. Oh my god, how did. Why am I being so bad at deflecting right now? Embarrassing. Loot. Yeah, 
I guess we could go to the left and down or just fight our way through there. I don't claim to try my luck here. Oh, never mind. I'm gonna fight a level 16. But I am clearly missing something here. Oh, hello. Like this dude found us. Oh, shit. This mission is just going splendidly, isn't it? I don't know what is wrong with my freaking deflection timings at the moment. But I just cannot get them right. I just cannot. Well, at least I don't have to fight you again. I feel like I'm getting a little bit too impatient or something. Because I tend to deflect too soon at the moment. Which is not good. Not good. Are you supposed to go this way? All right then. You have to be able to lower the water somewhere around here. Today. 
I reckon he's just trying to look good in front of boss. Boss. Wouldn't surprise me if some treasure was nearby. I think. Ah, there we go. So I guess this is the way forward. I mean, there was something else on the other side, but it would have to go all the way around again. I'm going to probably end up there eventually anyway, so I kind of don't see the point of doing that right now. Did I see? She doesn't come very far, does she? Oh, fuck. I can't see shit here. Like, this was all very chaotic. <laughs> A mocking flag here. I wonder if the speedrun actually picks up all these flags. Because you have to boost your morale somehow during these missions, don't you? I mean, otherwise, they're just getting one shot by the bosses. I'm aware. That was a complete miss. Getting hit by everything. Oh shit. Oh, that opens up the back of the shortcut. Alright, still not done. So we don't have to go through the canal again. Should we die? I hope not, obviously. 
but uh, hey, I never know, right? Wow, what is wow? Oh god, what did they do? Slow and steady does it in a spot like this. Wow, okay. Jeez. Was it initially announced as a fifty dollar game? That's quite a bit of a markup. It, it kind of sounds like to me, oh yeah, hey, you know, the game has gotten positive press during the demo. So, we don't need the goodwill anymore, quote unquote. We can just go ahead and check up the price again. Oh wait, you could already buy it? I mean, I guess you could just pre-order some. Huh? <laughs> well, waiting for a sale it is. Because if they can up the price, I can wait for it to drop. <laughs> Easy as that. I don't know, it, it just doesn't feel like that is a game that the developer can really win, is it? Oh, the digital are like... What, what? Yeah, right? Weird pricing. Morale four. Right. Oh god, guys, don't push me down there. The fuck. Can we not fight here? Thanks. <laughs> That guy didn't see me is a mystery to me, but I'll take it. So why come? Oh, it's water's not lowered yet down here. Let's see. Okay, yeah, we were on the other side of that. Okay. 
and this thing over. Car. Oh, this car. Was that cutting enough? Oh, that's a sheet to show. That's stalwart protector, kind of. Okay, what do I have to feed you? Heavy cavalry spear. Mm, yeah, why not? There you go. <laughs> We got the ditzy flute. Right. That was surely worth it. Why do you get water damage and flame attack power on the same item? I mean, obviously it's random, but... <laughs> Is that normal for pandas to just poop out items? And god damn, must be one hell of a digestive system. Oh, that wasn't even another guy there. I didn't even see the second dude. I only saw the guy that I shot. Let's see, you're not very smart, are you? I have the high ground. Dude, I literally have the high ground. Why are you trying to come up here? <laughs> Idiot. Have you ever seen Star Wars before? You have the high ground, you win. It's an automatic win condition. Like an if or, you know, if have high ground, you win. Simple as that. How the fuck do I get in there? Maybe later. So I go and do weapon as a win, since Sonic Phoenix always gives you the high ground. <laughs> I see. Makes sense to me. Makes sense to me. I knew it. Got a I guess his weapon is the only one that has that ability, right? Oh, are there other weapons that can have that ability? Oh, hello. 
I remember you and your ilk. Yeah, direct. Hmm, okay. To be fair, so far with my selection of uh, who I want to try and become friends with, I only thought about the armor sets. I haven't thought about the weapons that much yet. Maybe I should do that. Oh, damn it. Eh. Wait, I came from here, right? Yes. So far into this already. Chocolate. Oh, there we go. Dax is a DMC combat. These don't look conspicuous at all. Who would have thought that they come to life? Surely not me. you a little bit too late but i saw you little marquis hoverts Oh, that instantly destroys it. Well, that's easy. That is easy. Oh, hey, now that you caught it, John. Oh, does that lead to that uh, mocking flag that we saw earlier? I would imagine that to be the case, and I was right. Nice.
Hey, don't tell me they can't see me when I'm up here. Oh my god, she is blind. On the water, I mean, okay. But did you really do that on a battlefield? You know, not so sure about that. Oh my god! Oh my god! I like that that insta kills them. I mean, emphasis on dirty, I would say, you know, seeing as this is a sewer. Ah. I was wondering, okay, what did you die to? Guys, could you not block me? Like, I know you're excited to be part of all of this, but goddamn, the body blocking is real. Sorry for these enemies, actually. <laughs> uh, this is water. Okay, so I have to get rid of more water somehow. Do I have to come back here later? You know, I, was, I would assume so. I think the becoming sentient part is like uh, the big thing when it comes to that. Oh. Unrelenting thirst for battle. Okay. Where? Oh, there he is. Come here, you dits. So I have to face a single one of these invasions that actually poses a challenge, but then I'd also do dumb shit like that just now. I mean, let's be real, yeah, this dude is just getting bullied right now. I was like, can we not fight over there, please? That's a shortcut back. Yeah. Okay, so I just gotta remember the next time I drain water to come back to where we just were downstairs. Oh, hello. 
Not the button I wanted to press, but okay, here we go. Now I want to press it. statue ah there okay we lower the water again so i guess i could just go back into the canal where we just were and claim that treasure chest now right let's quickly go ahead and do that and this is a long mission oh, jesus Yeah, there we go. Down there. I guess with stories, you mean the historical accounts, quote unquote. Dragon Wayne! Oh, my lovely Dragon Wayne. Why did it work my guard? I have no idea. I don't know why we need that hype music, but okay. <laughs> Do we ever come back to that bridge where I died at the beginning? It kind of feels like we're getting further and further away from there. This isn't looking ominous at all.
Huh? Oh, up there. Oh, is he already active? Tower's backyard key. Oh my god, we finally found it. <laughs> How did that key end up here, though? Like, holy crabobbles. Oh, I can see the last mocking flags. Oh, come on, that is bullshit. All right, that's all the mocking flags. Now only the battle flags remain. One being here. Oh, that one better than expected. <laughs> I knew there was something back here. I just knew it.
Yeah, this. <laughs> oh my god, this is literally all the way back here now, finally. Also, I'm so glad that they changed this input that it is not R2 anymore because goddamn, that was just painful. Hello. He was kind of overconfident, wasn't he? Just look at that. You best give it a try. Okay, we're back here. Uh, wrong button. Get rid of that dude first. And then we'll get our revenge on you. Just like that. Ow. Ow. This is not well, I can still fight. That guy just jumped over the railing into the water. He fucking did, did he? on the boss then their morale will be in tatters now so more mad oh only three levels this time huh all right all right oh let's see it what are we fight I fighting the blue again we're fighting Lu Bu again. I swear to God. We've taken Pu Yang back once more. The wretch Lu Bu managed to slip away. Huh. Fled with his tail between his legs. Huh? Are you a Shao soldier? Huh? Well, fuck. Now we meet Birdman. Man, these elixir errors are kind of shitty. I just saw he leaves fire all around. Superman. Shit.
Christ, dude, calm down. Armor of staunchness. Hey, good. Hey, good. It's the eye. Stand I want you to eat your own eye. The Shao Duan I know is not the sort of man to give up so easily. Does this work? Wherever our army bravely charges, we've been there to give our blades and support. It's up to us, the Shaho clan, to guide Munda on the path to victory. My arrow will pierce any who dare to raise their blade to him. He's like a brother to us. But your genuine chi is formidable. You knocked sense into me when I was in my demonic rage. So maybe you'll not be needing my bow, huh? It's no mystery why boss rates you so highly. We'd follow you into death's abyss without hesitation. We'll ensure he commands over all of the land. You just watch. All right. That's a long ass arrow there, dude. You were young. Ow. How did you get an eye patch so quickly? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I owe you one. <laughs> Glad to have you back. I couldn't die before seeing you end the chaos across the land. <laughs> <laughs> the flag of the Lubu army has been raised at Xiaopei City Tower. Hmm. That Lubu. Ever impatient to bite at his next prey. <laughs> Zhu Quan. I guess is how that is pronounced. Maba. A little bit. Uh, just a little bit. Uh. I've heard that Xiao Pei was stripped from you in Xuanta's absence. It was. It was the booze! Otherwise, they would have never... Did I not warn you enough times? <laughs> it's my fault! <laughs> I will redeem myself by offering up this lie! You clumsy fool! <laughs> 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 Do not be so ready to throw your life away. Remember the oath we took. Brother. If you were to die, I too would follow you in death. Then I, Zhang Fei, will take back Zhao Pei single-handedly. I won't fail you again. Yida, just calm down for a moment. I shall accompany you, and I too. Your mistakes are our mistakes, brother. 
Brothers, let's shake the ground beneath their feet. <laughs> Will you lend us your hand as well? I am thankful to have an ally with such compassion and honor as yourself. And who isn't drunk all the time, I suppose. Throw the way the whole province. <laughs> After all that happened, we at last find ourselves in Shu province. Since I have promised the people, I am responsible for it and cannot abandon it. I hope I can reclaim the territory without Minister Cao's help. We'll do it! Our brotherhood will see us to victory! Mm -hmm. pays ours! Yeah, maybe boast about it once he's actually done it, idiot. <laughs> Uninhibited heart. Mm -hmm. Way of the warrior. Okay, first of all, let's go back to the village and give that woman her backyard key back. Ooh, that means I can also go ahead and loot whatever is there. <laughs> Some more metal. I really haven't looked at more of the wizardry spells, have I? Complete wizardry spell mastery. What does that mean? Oh, is it like Neo where you have to do the uh, tutorial missions? Oh, that's actually not too bad, I guess. Perfect restore. Oh, this one's kind of cool. Scorch spinner. Since you can only have uh, like four spells at a time, like really remove, um, really limits what you can have. Also, I'm really not using a life wither a lot, am I? Probably think about using that a little bit more. Uh, anyway, let's have a talk to the people around town again. Feng Shen? Is it really him? Well, no wonder Hong Jing seems so preoccupied. Oh, is that Lu Bu's true name? This place was once barren. When a crane came, genuine and soon yeah. after. Everyone here lives each day a food I can scarcely... Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Thing of which, we did get a new Divine Beast. Which one was it? Was this one? Oh, wait, we already had these. They just got powered up. That is when you unlock their fourth ability thing. Right? Yeah.
Um, good with what I have. Okay, I'm not gonna talk to you just yet. Just wanna grab all of that stuff back there. Thank you. You found the key to my backyard. You're a lifesaver, really. You're incredible. Now I can finally go back to my normal life. Only took us a couple of years to find that key. Oh, right. Those. Yes, I also noticed there are quite a lot of them. Honestly, I have no clue why they're there. They don't appear to belong to anyone, so I guess you're free to do what you like with them. Really? You want the keys to those chests? Wait, what? Then how about you trade me something that I'm after? They're locked. I think I can persuade the blacksmith to forge a key that will open Oh, them. fuck you, lady. Here you go. You want the keys to... Then I think... Perhaps you'll find this use. You want the keys? Then I think I. Here you go. The chests? Honestly, they don't appear to belong to anyone. Was a bit meh. <laughs> this though. So, who are you? Why can't I talk to you? Oh. Best spot here. Hmm. Oh, that is behind the blacksmith. Wait, that was what? Huh? There has to be more around here, right? Or not. Okay, then. Splendid indeed. I had wanted to, but perhaps. Huh? What's that? A new tablet? Let me see. Hmm. Ah, uh, yes, I see. Whoa! I can't believe the effort you've put in for my selfish requests. Thanks to you, I've been living a life free of boredom. I owe you so much. Here, a token of my gratitude. Mm. Master says that we I can't even. Something, I guess. I assure you, you're steady. Let's give the Takata shells to the guy up top. <laughs> Give me. Are you okay, buddy? <laughs> it's 
a bit uh yeah i don't know Hermit's gonna hermit, I guess. He's a hermit already. You I don't remember that detail well, unfortunately. Yeah, blah blah blah. Nope. Have a look at all the shit that we've got. Shall we? Ah, uh, yeah, I don't need you. Ah. Stars. Can I use any ugly two stars? Can just get rid of this as well. This is a nice one. Fuck you in, but that also means I don't need you anymore. Or you. I definitely don't need you either. I'm with you. I don't need you. Okay. Plus seven. Calf. Joan. A million bird girls. Oh, it's part of a set too. Spare. I guess I can keep that for now. So as though I think this one is better than this one. So now, but I can get rid of the.
Yeah, this one might be better. Yeah. Then again. Nah. Oh, hey, our friends from upstairs are back. I'm gonna keep you. Two star. I'm gonna keep it just for the set bonus. I already have these. Oh, that's tough. Definitely gonna upgrade this. Oh, it scales with earth more than just with metal? Oh. Oh wait, this wasn't the one that I had equipped. No, it is. What? No, it is the one, right? Next time we change that. Welcome. Maybe we should start investing into Earth more again. <laughs> oh, 
go another other are you still ill or again I we'll probably do this or you know the basic training you know what let's do some basic training <laughs> maybe there is something it's the same one oh shit they will actually learn something here that I hadn't known before. Lock on, switch target. Normal attack, spirit attack. Martial arts. Flecked. Oh, this, this is what shrinks the low end of the enemy spirit cage. Wait, what? Oh? I did not know that. I don't know about the zoom function either. Is it a spell? That was the wrong button.
keep forgetting about this. Oh, it's um. All right, yeah, I did not know about that uh, deep weapons watch there. Do the other training mission too, so we can uh, unlock more wizardry spells, I suppose. Wizardry spell mastery. Bypass adversity. For when you overcome it, the she that flows within you shall know no bounds. Now she imparted these wise words and arranged a trial designed to push the limits. Water must be restored to this world of wobble of chaos, so not turn your back on this challenge. And we shall not. Let's get going, shall we? Do I just have to fight? Oh, hello. Shaman, my God, can you die? There you go. Why does that sound like it will only be one? Suspicious. Uh. 
Let's check. Yeah. yeah. There is more stuff that I still need to do. But there are a couple more spells that I can uh, learn now if I wanted to. I don't. It's damaged enemies it touches. Really cured. Oh. Okay, that's interesting. Hmm. That doesn't sound too interesting. I don't think. But yeah, that is all that. Oh, the attack power of this thing is actually pretty close to this. Was it because of the weapon scale or the attribute scaling? Maybe. Oh well. Anyway, people, um, I guess that does it for today. I've been going for quite a while here. <clears throat> and I'm getting kind of hungry. I have to walk the dogs and all of that stuff. <laughs> so let's go on ahead and find you guys a raid target. Oh. There we go. Thank you for the follow. Strike load. Much appreciated. Um, it's a question of who do I send you over to? Maybe we have Sinif playing some Final Fantasy VI, I guess. <laughs> yeah, no worries. I'll definitely be back playing this um, uh, next week at the latest, I would say. So if you want to see more more long, do stick around for that. Um, we also have... Oh, Bowie is doing Octopath 2 speedruns. Or oh, we have Bobby doing lots of Shadow Mirror of Fate, you know, the 3DS game of that series. I want to see either Bowie or Bobby. But I also want to get away from that drilling. I guess we just go ahead and send you over to Bobby. You know, just, because the 3DS shop closed down. And he's playing some 3DS games in order to, you know, uh, see what he missed or whatever. So let's Hi. say hello to that dude. As always, everybody, thank you so much for watching. It's appreciated. Thank you to Cast for the big raid. That was definitely appreciated as well. Have a wonderful morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you guys are. Stick around after the raid to say hi to Bobby. I will be back probably on Sunday with some shenanigans. And if not, I will be there next week with more Wall Long and Like a Dragon Ishin speedruns. So we can finally see if we can push a little bit closer to that four hour barrier there. And with that, I'm out for the day. See you soon, everybody. Bye bye. Say hi to Bobby.